Hey, hey developers. Creating a new view website is really easy nowadays, but how do you add in SEO? What are the best practices? How do you make your site rank number one on Google? We're gonna look at different plugins we can use, different frameworks, and different styles of rendering our application. If you find this information useful, make sure you leave a comment, like this video, and let's take a look at this. So the first thing we need to consider is how we're going to create our application. What sort of tooling are we going to use? That way we can create a website that has a lot of SEO features available. So I really narrow this down between a couple of different frameworks in the Vue ecosystem that I really like. So one being VPress and the other being Nux3. Let's begin by looking at Nux3 and some of the rendering modes it has that can really help us with SEO. Universal mode is the default rendering mode for Nux3 three websites. Let's take a look at how that works. When you first visit a site in universal mode, the full HTML is sent to the browser and rendered right away. The website then downloads all the JavaScript in the background, although the website may not be completely interactive yet. After the JavaScript is completely downloaded, or you could say hydrated, the step is complete and the app is fully interactive at that point. While universal mode is great, static site generation is the best for SEO in my opinion. Imagine this process, let's say we have a website that has templates and content on it. We'll run the Nux generate command and this will generate the whole website and convert it to HTML and CSS. Those static files will then be deployed directly to your website and be available right away. Since you're dealing with CSS and HTML files that are static and very small, the server can load them very quickly and there's no hydration needed. If both of these modes sounds good to you, you can actually add them both to the same application. By using Nux route rules, you can add universal mode or SSR to some routes and static for static site generation to others. It's really flexible and you can do whatever you need. Though site speed is incredibly important for SEO, it's not the only consideration you should make. Adding titles and meta tags are also equally important and Nux has you covered there as well. You can use the use head composable to reactively create your titles and meta tags on each one of your pages on your site. You can also use server SEO meta instead, which offers some of the same benefits, but it's more of a flat object structure that you can use. Yet another way to handle this is use Nux built-in components, title, base, no script, style, meta, link, body, HTML, and head, and you can use those for SEO purposes. The other framework I would recommend is VPress. It's a V and view powered static site generator. It's perfect for those documentation sites, where you need markdown and it has some really nice features as well. Nice thing about VPress that everything is configurable. So you can add this title to the app configs to make the exact title that you want. And this would be a very good framework if you couldn't change the meta tags. And of course that is available by using the description in the app configs and you can set up all the meta tags that you need. So you're probably thinking, what if you already created your application and you're using something like Vite with Create View or even something old like Vue CLI for Vue 3? If you are using Vue CLI, you shouldn't be doing it. You should see my video on that. There are two libraries I'd recommend you use for your existing Vue apps, Vue Use Head and Vite SSG. At Vue Use Head, I find is the easiest way to add in tags, meta descriptions, titles to your Vue application. And it's really the successor to Vue Meta, which is really no longer maintained. To install and run npmi at Vue Use slash head, Add it to your app, you just need to go into your main TS file. You basically import in create head and then you use head inside create app. In the main app.view file, you can import use head in. And at this point you can go ahead and use it. So use head just like any other composable. It takes an object, you can put the title in, in this case, my title of my site. And then you can also put in some meta information in and just put the tags in that you want. For example, a meta name tag called description. Vite SSG is the other library I'd recommend. So it works really well with Vue Use Head. It's actually in the official documentation. So it's a static site generation for Vue 3 on Vite. And it doesn't take too much configuration to get up and running. You have to go into your package JSON and add this new Vite SSG build. You have to make some changes to your main TS file. You have to have a router as well. Um, otherwise it won't work correctly. Uh, you can do it using this other Vite SSG single page if you're trying to do it without the router but it's just a few configurations and then you can get add static site generation into your Vite app, into your new Vue Create app. And I think it's well worth it for this speed improvements. 
Hey, so I hope you learned something about SEO and VIEW. I want you guys to leave a comment below. Let me know what you think. Also, thank you for watching all the way to the end of the video, and I hope you have an amazing, great day.